Good morning, guys. <laughs> Welcome to another vlog. Today, we're going to see if we can get my bike done. Painted. I have taken it out the paint. I haven't edited the other video. I didn't even finish the other video. So, right now, I'm going to go outside and paint it. I don't know if I'm going to take this on my GoPro. I'm probably going to take my GoPro because what happened the last time he dropped my camera and broke. And the broke my, my my lens thing. It's kind of broken, but I got the replacement. I'm waiting for the replacement to get here. So I'm gonna leave this camera inside and just take the GoPro so I can time lapse everything. And hopefully it looks nice. I will do a breakdown on how much everything costs to get done and how everything is. Huh? What a circle. Yeah, the circle thing. Don't worry about it. So yeah, so I'm gonna leave this camera inside. I'm gonna take the GoPro out. It's much easier, much better to film with, I guess. To thing, I forgot I had this one little thing that you could put the GoPro into a tripod. But yeah, I'm gonna leave this in here. I'm waiting for the replacement so I can replace the back. Like the lens still works. I'm still using the 10 millimeter. You get used to it. I have another lens, but the 10 to 18 gets used to it, and you get used. To I have a legit like hand size from the camera. So yeah. So let's get outside. I have to wait 15 minutes because I had to put more paint stripper. Paint didn't come off completely. And I don't have freaking acid uh, the, the acetone to clean off the excess stuff and I don't have stronger a stronger grid. Yeah. So I put more paint strippers so I could just paint strip the whole rest of the frame. I have to wait 15 minutes and just like swipe it down, clean it, and then get a prefer paint. Technically, it's pretty nice outside today. It's a good day to go to the skate park, but, but it's gonna be cold, I thought so too. I thought so too, but I guess it's going to be warm. i just waiting for that and then I just have to paint it, let it be for like an hour, hour and a half or an hour, and then build it back up. But in the way of building, I'm gonna be cleaning my rims and putting my rims back together because I bought a new axle for the back. New axle, it's still the same axle for the front and stuff like that. So yeah, it's a process to do this, but I will do a breakdown video on how much I spend on everything. <laughs> so it's kind of of the expense. <laughs> I forgot to get one thing, the fork. It's kind of bad, so I'm just gonna, I bought the paint for it too. I'm gonna paint strip it while I paint the, the frame, and then paint this. So everything's gonna be technically clean up. I have to clean the rims. I have to clean everything. What? Sorry. Yeah, but you still have a lot of Pokemon cars. He's over there talking about Pokemon. He's on the floor right there. But yeah, I'm going to paint strip that and start painting the bike because it's a nice day and I have a lot of more plans to go. So yeah. Yes, I am still here because I have to finish it. No, you went in there. My spray paint, the thin was clot, and I used my drill to open it. What the fuck happened? And this got blue. My drill got blue because it was clot. It was clot. It was completely clot. It didn't want to come out. And then I popped it, and then it started squirting all over the place. And then... So you see that? That's all the paint. That's the spray paint. A good, nice spray paint. Spilled all over the place. Put some Clorox in this. Oh, 
it's gonna go away once it rains. It's Did technically they... old dirt. It's gonna go away, trust me. Because I, all the air came out. Clorox is not gonna take that out. Clorox never takes paint out. It goes away. It's just paint. I know. 15% of the GoPro. Alright. I suggest to you, for you to... Bye-bye. See, look. This one works. Fuck is that a... Well, what is this? The pilot? Black. No, this is black, black. Matte black. Oh, well, stain. Stain black. It's good for metal. Careful with your face. Maximum protection. No, I'm really gonna say that. Careful with your face. This paint plus primer. This is paint plus primer, and then that one is gloss, so it makes it look shiny. All right, I'm gonna start putting the stuff together. All the rest of the components, like the wheels together and stuff. I'm probably gonna time lapse with my GoPro, much easier. Still waiting for the stuff to come back so I can fix this lens. So it doesn't bounce, gets up a thing, and I have to hold it still. But yeah, I'm gonna start putting the wheels together. Everything's gonna be black. Paint my face. It's bad. My eyes still, still hurting. My guess swollen. I don't know. It looks a bit swollen. We'll see. So let's start putting everything together. <laughs> is done all i have to do is just clean it up make it look pretty shine it up a little bit just clean it but oh yeah and change my my grips because i got turquoise grips it's supposed to be imagine the bike but the bike is a different complete color 
which sucks, but that's what happens when you buy paint from Amazon and I don't have any paint here, so I'll show you the bike. I guess it looks nice like this. Just gonna have turquoise grips. Or just put everything <laughs> the way it is. Look at that. Took me only three hours. Well, I actually took it apart the other day, took everything apart. And then today I just decided to paint it because it's a good day. It's pretty nice. I'm just gonna go take it for a little spin. I'm just gonna take it for a little spin so you make sure everything works. And I'm waiting for my lens thing. This lens just cut off, so hopefully it doesn't mess up my camera. But yeah, look at that. I had to go black because I was not gonna leave it raw. I don't like it. <laughs> All right, it been so long. After I finished, I finished the whole bike. Painted it, put it all together. I still have to put in the straps. Didn't come out the way I wanted. But yeah, hopefully you enjoy all the mess up that I did and what happened to me. I still have to clean the bike, clean it out, let it dry completely, clean out the paint, and tap it a little bit, I guess, on the, on the spot that I got a little bit the paint came off. So, oh man, I'm tired. I'm doing schoolwork because, yeah. I have school and then it's due by 12.59 so <laughs> it's, it's crazy but I'll probably finish within like about an hour or so have five more stuff five more four more yeah hopefully I enjoy this uh like and subscribe thank you for watching and hopefully you enjoy me restoring a Fuji a old Fuji I don't know that has a serial number is 50 50 I don't know what that means. It doesn't have no other serial numbers. It has 50. I'm guessing that's the 50th frame they made. I don't know. I'm going to do some research on it. So thanks for watching. Like I said, stay tuned for more. There will be more. And like and subscribe. Welcome if you're new.